uh-uh, and you know you have to follow the rules. Keep your cell phones off, all that good stuff. Okay, ready? Should I do a countdown or something, or you just want me to bring them out? Just bring them out. All right, I will just bring them out. Here we go. Capital recording artist, Lady Antebellum. Here they are. Woo! Hello there. Sorry if you were expecting Garth Brooks or something. <laughs> a little anticlimactic. <laughs> we're not very famous. Uh, but they get free food when you come. Yeah, you though. get free food. We're Lady Annabelle, and we're uh, out of Nashville, Tennessee. And uh, I'm Hillary. Yep, Hillary. My name is Charles. And I'm Dave. How y'all doing? We're brand new, so I know y'all don't know us, but uh, we're going to play a few <laughs> little songs that we've written. Yeah. Here we go. Let's do it. One, two, three. Slow down, sister, because I just can't love you. But I just can't get you off my mind Well, I ain't your fool I'm not for real I'm not falling in love with you I play by my rules And believe me You don't want me too close to you And even though You look so fine I've been on this broken road One too many times so slow down, sister, cause I just can't love you, but I just can't get you off my mind. Oh, and Lord knows I need you, but I just don't want to put this rusty heart up on the line. I've heard people say that I'm crazy, that I'm crazy for avoiding you. But honey, I got my freedom and my reasons. All the reasons for what I do But that last kiss won't just stick me in And I don't want to look at you as something more than just a friend Oh, so slow down, sister, cause I just can't love you But I just can't get you off my mind Oh, and Lord knows I need you, but I just don't want to put this rusty heart up on the line. Whoa, slow down, sister. I gotta make you mine. Well, all I'm asking for is just a little time. sister cause I just can't love you but I just can't get you off my mind oh lord knows I need you but I just don't want to put this rusty heart up on the line slow down sister whoa 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 yeah uh huh won't you slow down slow down slow down just a one time Oh, 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 yeah. Thank you. Thank you very much. Well, we are so happy to be in Cleveland. Or Akron. Cleveland. We're in Akron, actually, now. We were in Cleveland earlier. Yes. I can honestly say that's never happened to me before. Yeah, this is your first. Woo, am I blushing? <laughs> well, at least it wasn't like something just. Hello, absurdly. Detroit. Yeah. No. Seattle, y'all are beautiful. <laughs> Just a few miles up the road, right? But um, so we just heard our song on the radio, which that was kind of fun. I think today that's single. like the third time we've heard it on no, the radio. No, that's like the second time ever. Second. It was second huge. Times. But um, <laughs> to give you a little background, the three of us met um, a little over a year and a half ago now, I guess. Yep. Found this one on MySpace. She's a stalker. I'd She's never, stalker. ever... Sent him a message. I just went and would listen to his music, and I thought he was really good. Not just good looking, good. Tr and um, truth comes out. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> and um, I loved the songs he was writing, and I randomly one night in Nashville saw him and kind of walked up to him, and I was like, you look so familiar. What is your name? Which they think is like a line, which it wasn't. That was totally a line. <laughs> and uh, he was like, Charles Kelly. And I said, well, I'm Hillary, and I'm a singer-songwriter from here in Nashville, and I just want you to know that I think you're great. And so then he took it upon himself to go, well, well, let me get your number, and um, 
we can get together and write some songs. <laughs> and so I said, yes. okay. <laughs> Best pickup line ever. <laughs> <laughs> and we did. And um, a couple months later, after writing, 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 and playing a show, we decided maybe Start we should a be a group. And that's kind of how Lady Annabellum formed. Really crazy, random, organically. And now I'm going to shut up and sing an angry little song. Mm. Candy Carbo in bed with the red head. She threw a fin and a fern and the F word at the both of them. She peppered him with babies cause she couldn't find the 12 gauge. So Cindy Lou, I know your husband and there's gonna be hell to pay. There ain't nothing. Nothing more dangerous than a country girl trading her halo for horns. The neighbors knew they were in for a war. They saw a screaming half naked waffle house waitress flying off the porch. And no one slams the door like a woman's song. That came back, Bo was zipping up his levers. She chased him around the kitchen, he was trying to apologize. He got a nine, nine and a one for she landed that left hook. She knocked him out cold, candy stronger than she looked. There ain't nothing, nothing like a woman. Nothing more dangerous than a country girl trading her halo for horns. The neighbors knew who was winning that war. They saw a half naked, bleeding husband who'd been cheating, spread eagle on the porch. And no one slams the door like a woman's scorn. for the one-man band down here. <laughs> there ain't nothing like a woman's scorn. There ain't nothing more dangerous than a country girl trading her halo for horns. And oh, she swears all fair. Said if you want to be a dog, I'll treat you like a dog. You're sleeping on the porch. And no one slams the door like a woman's song. Like a woman's song. Yeah, for him Sounded like we got some scorned women in the <laughs> audience. <laughs> Can be your new anthem if you want it to be. I know. Yeah. <laughs> well, uh, we're going to slow it down. We're going to play the first song that three of us ever wrote uh, together. Uh, like she said, she kind of came over and we started out as a writing group. He never got a date, though. I, I did. No <laughs> date. I think my problem was I told her this story. I'd moved to Nashville and uh, just gotten out of this three year relationship with this girl. And so I'm sitting here telling a girl. Who I, you know, I kind of was planning on asking out on the date after we wrote the song. And I How go, in love with his ex girlfriend yeah, like, he was. Man, I'm still just, I miss I this go, girl. <laughs> wow, he's coming across extremely emotionally unavailable. Yeah, so I ruined my chances right there. <laughs> but, um, but, anyways, we wrote this song um, kind of about my situation. Um, Dave and I had this melody and idea for a while, and we really were struggling with writing it. And, and it honestly wasn't until Hillary kind of came in that day and um, just kind of helped me put it all into words it was it was a really cool kind of moment and uh yeah so it's he called you just a needed female perspective i did <laughs> don't <Right>? we all <laughs> i love this all the women are like yeah <laughs> girl power um this is called all we'd ever need
the way it's been all this time and I can't get you off my mind and nobody knows it but me I stare at your photograph still sleep in the shirt you left and nobody knows it but me every day think I'm moving on but the truth is I'm not that strong and nobody knows it can be and I've kept all the words you said in a box underneath my bed and nobody knows it can be but if you're happy somehow but the truth is that I've been screaming out. I should have been chasing you I should have been trying to prove that you were all that mattered to me and I should have said all the things that I kept inside of me and maybe I could have made you believe that what we had was all we dare ever need it was all we ever need chasing you you should have been trying to prove that you were all that mattered to me and oh, oh you should have said all the things that I kept inside of me and maybe you could have made me believe there was out up here. Can you turn me down just a little bit? Seriously. I wasn't going to say anything. No, it was good. Don't ever accuse me of being a diva. <laughs> <laughs> I just turned myself down. I know. That was nice. <laughs> well, uh, I'll pick it up. I'll do a little Even something. I am the lady. And something lady fun here. How was dinner? Was it good? I love me some rhymes. I know. I need a little meat and three. I hadn't had it in a long time. I know. Ready? What was the best part? Macaroni and cheese? Did you have macaroni and cheese? Don't make me hungry. Can you tell I'm hungry? <laughs> no, I'm starving. <laughs> this song's called Love's Looking Good. Well, ooh, baby, baby, something's 
Everyone's just a little bit different in your eyes tonight. Well, they look twice as bright. Baby, baby, something's changed that I can't quite put my finger on. Well, I've been racking my brain. Wait just a minute. Hold on now. Well, I get it. Love, love, love is looking good, good, good on you. Well, can you feel it? Oh, everybody sees it. And your sweet smile has a way of lighting up the room. Yeah. Shine like diamonds you shine like diamonds too Oh love, love, love is looking good, good, good on you Well, ooh, baby, baby Well, isn't it funny how we don't need any money Just a little luck To look like a million bucks Kind of makes you think that the stars are in sync on the night we met. There ought to be a red carpet everywhere you go, rolling on out. Hey, don't you know that love, love, love's looking good, good, good on you? Well, can you feel it? Oh, everybody sees it. And your sweet smile has a way of lighting up the room. And girl, you shine like. Shine like diamonds too. Oh, love, love, love's looking good, good, good on you. I knew right away from the very first kiss first that it kiss. doesn't get much better than this. We feel just, just like a favorite pair of jeans. And we just keep coming back for more. I'm like two kids in a candy store. And now I know what every Looking good, good, good on you. Well, can you feel it? Oh, everybody sees it. And your sweet smile has a way of lighting up the room. Yeah, you shine like diamonds. You shine like diamonds do. Oh, love, love, love's looking good, good, good on you. Well, I'm telling you, mighty, mighty good, babe. Love, love, love's looking good, good, good on you. Love's looking good on you. Love, love, love's looking good, good, good on you. Thank you. Yeah, all right. Dave was asked if we want to do a cover. Y'all want to hear a cover song or something? I don't know. Something you might something know. Something you know? Because you're hearing a bunch of songs you don't? Let's do a little Doobie Brothers. Any Doobie Brothers fans? Anybody? Me. Anybody? You guys are crazy wild. Come on. Yeah. <laughs> are y'all in food comas? <laughs> yep, that's what it is. I got guilty looks on your face. <laughs> it is Monday. It is Monday. Appreciate y'all listening, guys. Down around the corner, a half a mile from here, you see them long trains running, then you watch them disappear without Without love. love. Where would you be now? Without love Well, you know I saw me loose Down around them tracks She lost her home and her family But she won't be coming back Without love Oh, child Where would you be now? Without love Southern Central Freight You gotta keep on pushing, mama Cause you know they're running late Without love 
where would you be now? Without love Oh, in a good time Oh, child Be my <laughs> well, the pills will keep on turning, and the wheels go round and round, and the steel rails will cut in half of the miles that they go down without love. Oh no, where would you be now? Without love. Without love All the time during the show, they y'all miss me him. Off. You want to do a solo? I'm used to it. <laughs> just kidding. <laughs> um, y'all want to hear a single? We'll play you. Uh, um, this uh, is the current single we, we just have a had. Single. I know it's kind of cool to say. We have um. a single. <laughs> You're such a we just heard it on the radio, too. She's Did I tell you that? Such a goober right here, man. <laughs> <laughs> but it's called uh, Love Don't Live Here. This is probably the fifth song that the three of us wrote what? together. And uh, it's what, what are you talking You're about? You're right. Lights? Oh, I know, man. <laughs> These lights are like... Get that natural... Woo! I do have a blue on me. I look great in blues. <laughs> That's in my rider, so thank you. Nice. For this. nice. Blues. I want, I want the light to be reflecting off my headband. <laughs> Since it's real sparkly. Yeah, that is a pretty rock This is headband. what happens when you have a bad hair day right here. <laughs> <laughs> I just thought you wanted to be Cinderella or something. Maybe. Maybe. Well, it's called uh, Love Don't Live Here, and... Uh, Want to hear it? Here it goes. Well, this heart of mine, it's been hard and like a stone. It might take some time to get back to what is gone. But I'm moving on, and you don't haunt my dreams like you did before. Oh, and I will curse your name oh, yeah. Well, I heard the news That you were back in town And just passing through To claim you're lost and found But I'm over you And there ain't nothing there Say I do and take what you did back. For well, you got nerve to walk spread and think what's mine is yours again. Cause I've been doing fine without you. We're getting all the love we once do. And girl, I ain't the one to slam that door. Oh, well, should know. And now you say you change your thinking. But I ain't got a heart for a breaker. So go and pick your bags up off my floor. Oh, cause love don't live here anymore. Oh, no. 
Well, sugar, you can try to tell me how it is and try to justify everything you did. But, honey, I'm no fool. Oh, and I've been down this road too many times for you. I think it's best you go. Well, I got one thing left to say Is you can lay in the bed you made Cause I've been doing fine without you For getting all the love we wants to do And girl, I ain't the one to slam that door Oh, sure, good no And now you say you change your thinking But I ain't got a heart for breathing So go and pick your off my floor Yeah, cause love don't live here anymore Oh no That love don't live here anymore Oh no, no Oh, should no, no You don't live here anymore I don't live here anymore And since you walk out of my door I don't live here, I don't live here, girl Oh, I don't live here anymore Thank you guys. Thank you very much. We're Lady Annabellum. That's our time. Thank you. I appreciate it. If anybody has any questions or anything, we're open. Oh, and we have some. Uh, we for have Q and A, and, and we have we have yeah, we posters, pictures. If you guys, have, if you guys have questions, I can come to you. Raise your we hand. We love that. If you got we a good question, right over here. Okay. Can I set this on your table? Thank you. Just as long as it's not my, what my social security number is. Yes, we're not I allowed to ask those that. kind of questions. Okay. What's your name? <laughs> I'm Denise. Hi. Hi. I was just wondering, I know you probably explained it a million times, but talk to us about what your name of your band means. <laughs> <laughs> Doesn't mean anything, um, but it, we thought it sounded cool. We, um, we actually, we, ha we had a, a group of these songs together. We wanted to, again, getting back to the MySpace. We wanted to put up a MySpace. and um, Kind of all goes back to that I these know. days. Uh, we weird? didn't have a name yet, but we knew, you know, all right, we got these songs, we're going to do this. So we were like, well, let's go get some pictures, and hopefully in the meantime we'll come up with a band name. And, um, All the so other band names that we had found, we found at Cracker Barrel. You're horrendous. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I thought saw, Sawmill I'm Gravy was kidding. my pick. I thought that would have been I great. Mean, <laughs> we thought, you know, for a second, Sunrise Sampler might work. Yes, the Sunrise Sampler. But um, we found the the city name of Springdale on one of the tins, you know. Isn't that in Ohio? Up in the, I think it is. Is there a Springdale There is a Springdale Ohio? in Ohio. Spring right outside of yeah, I was going to say Springdale. There's a Springdale. Springdale. No. But there's Springdale outside of Cincinnati. Okay. Ah. I do know that. Oh, huh. I forgot See what we you were in Akron, Cracker but Barrel? I know that there's a Springdale, Ohio. <laughs> yep. um, but anyways, we had we I think we had settled on something like Springdale. We, so we I don't know. We weren't we weren't completely sold on it, but we were like, all right, well whatever, we'll just go get pictures or whatever. So my brother my brother's in town and he goes, All right, I'm not gonna take your picture by <laughs> a railroad track or a dirty barn. dirty old truck like all you country artists do. So he said, Let's do something original. Play off of you know the two guys and one girl. So he talks. I wanted them fighting yeah. over me. Yeah. So he <laughs> talks us into going into this costume store, and Hillary's dressed up as Scarlett O'Hare in this like hoop skirt thing. Dave and I are in these old Southern gentlemen outfit with swords, and we're out in front of these old antebellum homes, these big old white column homes, and we're fighting over Hillary essentially. <laughs> these pictures were. Which so I really liked. On it, it <laughs> sounds it sounds really really <laughs> trippy, and it really is. I don't know what made us do this, but a couple uh, beers at the pool. I don't know. <laughs> so for some reason, we thought this would be the funniest, coolest thing in the world. We're like, oh, people are gonna think this is hilarious. And uh, we end up taking these pictures. We put them up, and they're like, "What in the world?" All it got were gonna? people thinking we were gonna perform in yeah. in costume. Yeah. <laughs> it's like you can go up the road to get the Civil War reenactment <laughs> if you wanted, but it's not gonna be us. But somehow but through that, I think w you know we when we were in front of these old homes, we were like, "Antebellum." Those are some gorgeous antebellum homes, and we all were like searching for band names. Anytime anybody said a word that was cool, <laughs> we're like, 
That's a band um, name right there. So, uh, yeah, one of us was like, yeah, that's kind of cool. And um, I don't know. Hillary's really arrogant. She always wants to focus <laughs> on her. So, he, And he's given me more credit than I deserve because I didn't know what Annabelle meant. He had to tell, They had to tell me because I had no idea. You know what? I was thinking the same thing. I'm like, uh-huh, uh-huh. Yeah. Yeah. I have no clue Annabelle? that it was Auntie called actually, Annabelle. Yeah, Auntie Auntie is like the Latin. Those old colonial homes. So the pillars? Yeah, or yeah, the whole yeah. name yeah. of the house is called? Those big old the Gone with the Wind style, homes. Like, gotcha. I think we were told we were The true meating is actually... Ante is the Latin for before oh and bell for war, so it's before the Civil War is actually what it means. Who knew? Really, you. Yeah. So now Ooh. Lady Annabellum is just trying to educate America. Not right. Really. Educate America. No. <laughs> yeah. We're trying uh, to educate Ameri- uh, America <laughs> Ameri- with, Ameri- with, Ameri- with, Ameri- with Ameri- grammatical uh, <laughs> song titles like Love Don't Live Here. <laughs> My dad goes, you couldn't have just said Love Doesn't Live Here? And I was like, Dad, <laughs> love as- doesn't live here anymore. Just not as cool. Not the same but, thing. Um, but anyways, that's our anticlimactic fan story, Lady Yeah, Antibella. we we ran a, we we, we, <laughs> we went around the world to get your answer, but there it is. <laughs> well, I'm glad that you asked that because I was wondering that, but I didn't want to be the one to ask. No. <laughs> Just because I left the room for like five seconds and I thought I know they probably said what the name of their band <laughs> means. I had no idea we were gonna get a whole education. So yeah, thank you. Go. Yeah, look at that. I'm gonna teach that to my kids when I get home tonight. <laughs> when it shows up on first grade homework, I'm gonna be like, yes. "Hey, yes. I know yeah. this." Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. All right. Else Anybody on? else? Get your hands up. There we go. We yes. yes, we got Twice. to play it. Yeah, two times. We're actually playing it again. When? November second. Friday, November second. Yeah. If you wanna <laughs> drive down. But it was eight eight a cool. Our debut. Yeah. 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 Little getaway. Our debut is on June 29th. And I cried the whole time. She did. Yeah. Well, what well, the funny Whispering story? Whispering Bill Anderson. Yeah, Bill Anderson introduced, introduced us, and I don't know. We didn't tell y'all this, and she won't ever bring it up and brag. But her mother is Linda Davis. That Ooh. does he love you? Does we actually you? cover that in our show, and no, Charles and I fight over Dave. Yes, we do. No, we don't. That's a lie. So um, Charles, you're current. technically the other woman. I know. <laughs> <laughs> right. I get that a lot with his with his hairy beard. <laughs> But, uh, yeah, so Bill Anderson introduced us. It was the coolest thing, and he had introduced um, her mom and her dad. Her dad actually played guitar for um, Reba's, Reba McIntyre's band back in the day. So it was a really cool moment, and so she, honestly, the whole time was crying. I was like, he was like get it together. Whisper, he was whispering. Whispering Bill was whispering, going, so if he got over here, who are these two fellas with you? And I was like, Charles Kelly and Dave Haywood, we're just so happy to be here. <laughs> I mean, it was like, oh my gosh, to see the footage, I'm like, whoa. Yeah. Then Larry, now, calm down. The second time we played, we actually had Vince Gill introduce us, so that was, he's, he's my favorite Which made Charles artist. cry. No, no. <laughs> I didn't cry. <laughs> I had to get a hold of Charles. I was like, get it together, man. Ladies, I didn't cry. <laughs> All man right here. So, yes, we have, and it's one of those things, it's like when we get that call, we work around everything else to get there because... I mean, they just celebrated 82 years, the Grand Ole Opry did. Wow. Yep, and then Josh Turner gets inducted this weekend, which is a big thing. So we're, we've actually There's opened up for him. We've opened up for him a couple times. Yeah. He's a really nice guy. He is. And I'm happy for him. But you're, you're, when you're in there, we're, when he went on, you're, you're, we're like backstage listening to his music, and <laughs> honestly, your, your stomach like rattles when he like, sings. He's like, firecracker. <laughs> <laughs> just like that. It's just like that. <laughs> Yeah, good question. <laughs> Let's, anybody else? Anybody else? Okay, okay. Even if you just want to say how yell? great we are. <laughs> oh, she's going to yell. <laughs> I saw you guys at River Crest, and I wanted to ask Yay. how much fun was it to perform at River Oh, that was awesome. At CMA Fest? Yes. Yeah, that was great. That was actually... Awesome. That we was, didn't belong there. I know, I was about to say, <laughs> we, knew, we really didn't. No one knew who we were. I don't know wh- how we got asked to do that, but uh, that was the... Pretty the, one of the coolest moments I think of our early career. I mean, we're, all this is just going, and we're on our radio tour right now, and um, it was really cool because there were so many country fans, and I don't think they necessarily knew who we were, but we had a guitar in our hand, and we were like looked like artists, so I guess they were came up, and it was really cool. We'd have like these groups of people that get our autograph, and I was like, you don't even know who we are. <laughs> They're like, well, you might be famous next year. I was like, all right. I remember <laughs> wishing that I'd worn a dress because it was really hot. Yeah. yeah. And I would have liked I to breathe, too. but I didn't get one because I was wearing jeans. Yes, it was hot. That was, was hot. A, that was uh, poor. The, thing, the things girls <laughs> have. Sorry. But uh, that really was weird. That thing called a filter, like that you're supposed to have before you talk. Yeah. I don't really have a very good one, obviously. It would really would have been bad if you're like, I really wish I didn't wear underwear. Like, 
Then I, that would have been the filter. No, I'm not in the pop music world. <laughs> oh. oh. Wow. That was really good, wasn't it? Way to go, Hillary. That was a zinger. <laughs> That's what the kids are calling it these days. Zingers. A zinger? Yeah, zingers. <laughs> or maybe my dad. <laughs> what? Uh, anybody else have anything I want to ask? We, uh, what did we do? We're doing a week Michigan. of radio tour. Michigan. Michigan. Yeah, this is the last week of our radio tour. We've, we've, um, we've cut seven songs, and then out of the first seven, they, they picked a single, and so they're like, well, they really wanted to get us out you know, before the end of the year, so we had to put our um, record on hold, and we'll go back in November, December, and finish it up, and then hopefully the record will be out late February, early March, mm -hmm. somewhere, sometime around there, so... Yeah. It is. It's 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 not here at this station yet. So uh, <laughs> that's a joke. So uh, really joke. honestly, we heard it today. Honestly, though. honestly, that, he sounds ungrateful. He's I, not I ungrateful. Was, I was a joke. I was a joke. We heard it. I just I, I thought I assumed her next question would be, well, I haven't heard it yet. <laughs> well, you assume a lot. No, I'm just kidding. I'll ask that question the way we heard it yet. Hey. <laughs> Well, we hopefully, don't know the answer to that uh, question. Hopefully soon, but we're—I mean—we're early. It just went—it uh, just went for um, official ad date, is what they call it. And, and we uh, just shot our video like yeah, a week we ago did. too. So nobody Hillary, asked that question, but yeah, we Hillary did. was like in hog heaven. I oh hated it. Oh my gosh! <laughs> no, no. <laughs> I it left the Scarlett O'Hare at like, home. It felt like costumes. I it had some lady putting makeup all in my face. Fixing like, oh, like one piece. All of bit hair. of manhood just went right. Yeah, out all bit of manhood. I mean, I was like, really. She's like, yeah, you you really need some, and I was like, all right, thank you. <laughs> so it was fun. It was a long day. I had no idea that my call time would be 5 a.m. Yeah, and then we got and then we wrapped at 10, like 10, 10 p.m. And you're performing the whole time, so I mean, it's like on, you it's be like on. a it's like a 15 hour <laughs> performance basically. But it was it was fun. It was pretty wild. And uh, can't wait to see it. It should be hopefully done like by the second week in November. So yeah. hopefully it'll be well, on they'll the have a, They have, a, they have a, um, actually their debut in our, we have a bunch of We're just footage. rambling, aren't we? I know <laughs> we are. We're talking a lot. You get us started. We, um, <laughs> we, do a, we do a lot, take a lot of footage out on the road, actually. We took a little footage of this. Y'all might see yourselves Yourself. on a, You'll on be a, on Lady ATV. On a road video. Whether you signed off on it or not. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay, right? None of y'all um, are here with people you shouldn't be. Yeah. <laughs> nice. <No. laughs> but, um, <laughs> yeah, so we uh, we put together actually uh, had all this footage that we did um, for like kind of a little pre video that they're going to actually air um, Thursday on CMT during the countdown. And then, but our official video goes a few more weeks. Can you believe we're actually talking about this? Like that we cool. did it. It's crazy. It's pretty cool. It's crazy. It's crazy. Yeah, and we y'all can never know. Check, check out our MySpace. We have MySpace. Um, you never know what can happen on MySpace. Yes, we'll add you. Is that what you're asking? Can yeah. you be a friend? <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just kidding. Just kidding. <laughs> and we've got a website and all that stuff. So how are we doing on time? Are we good? I think we can go, you know, until you guys can't talk anymore. Okay. Mm. It's, like one, it's like Do a one. It's like a one a.m. show. This girl <laughs> will not <laughs> shut up if you say that. <laughs> well, she's pretty funny. I could just. I keep know. Listening. She's hilarious. She's on today. She's got the the zingers. The Go zingers. Away. Yeah, zzz. yeah. <laughs> what the kids are calling it. <laughs> you got to do the zzz. <laughs> yeah. Anybody else got any questions? All right. Well, yeah, <laughs> we're actually Charles. We picked him up on the side of the yeah, road. Yeah, I was just hi hitchhiking and then they found me. Yeah, so. yeah, yeah. Now Charles and I are actually both from Augusta, Georgia. We grew up together and playing in middle school and high school. He had a cooler band in we middle in, school. Yeah, we were in rival bands. Better his band got to play the middle school <laughs> dance, so his was much cooler. Not to not to get off on us another story, but just that we were we were kidding around talking about early band names that we had. And gosh, this is. My first band was called Spork, you know, like a <laughs> spoon and a fork. <laughs> we got from Kentucky Fried Chicken. And, and the we were, best part we were, is they'd wear them we as were necklaces. We were 12 years old, and we made little necklaces out of our sporks, so we would walk around in school. Y'all were cool. And uh, people would make fun of us so bad. I was like, dude, I'm in a band. You can't make fun of me. <laughs> so. Playing Nirvana at the dance. I was. No, but we actually kind of grew up and then um, both worked act after college in Georgia, and then Tell he quit. Tell what you did uh, for a living. Uh, I love to embarrass him. Well, it's not anything embarrassing. It's actually, I mean, I didn't even finish college, so. Oh, I know. They both Accountants. majored. Accountants. <coughs> Finance. Finance. Dave was an auditor. I don't don't boo him. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and Charles worked at a waste hauling company. Yeah, I was doing the, it was, I, was, I would do the books half the time, and then I'd go to the landfill and uh, dump trash. It was, I was like, I really want to go do music right now. I don't know. <laughs> 
I, I hated being behind a desk, and I don't know. Well, he quit his job and then talked me into quitting my job, and we moved to Nashville, and we're just songwriters, and then met Hillary. I'm te technically the newbie, I guess. She is. A lot of hazing going on. <laughs> yeah. I, I loved it, man. We went to sc school there. I love. Yeah, yeah. I'm really disappointed at the dogs this year. They're killing me. Ohio State's doing good, though. Yeah, that's <laughs> right. I know. But yeah, uh, I've got, I've got family back in Augusta, and he's got Steelers. family in North Carolina. Yeah, so yep. and, and none of us are married, or none of us are dating each other either. No. They're not dating. <laughs> We're not dating. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for pointing that out, because you know that was going to be the next yeah. question. Yeah. yeah. I'm sorry. Who, who's the couple out of the three? Have, have we dated each other? No. He never asked me out I didn't. on that day. I didn't. Honestly, it was one of those things. Hmm. I, I think the first day, you know, she came over when we wrote it. It just, it, I don't know. Does that one night count? Does that count? <laughs> <laughs> Date or? Yeah. Singer. Zing, zing, zing. Zing. But uh, no, we we never did. We we. I don't know. We figured we didn't want to pull a Fleetwood Mac, and we were like, this <laughs> we don't is, want a Fleetwood Mac anything. Yeah. <laughs> Everything was feeling it's so a verb good. Now. I was like, yeah. This, so uh, I don't know. Hands off. He's and she no. probably also once she went on the road with me, I'm, I'm just really, <laughs> <laughs> I'm just not a very clean dude. I think he forgets that there's a lady around. I do, sometimes. I do, I forget. Well, we're you know we'll go around with with three or four guys um, no. that, that back us up, and so there's so there's six guys in her in me. Yeah, it's pretty pretty brutal. They were really <laughs> talk about no filter. Six, six guys oh. will just start telling a story, and all of a sudden, you know, we'll go, oh, oh yeah, wait, there's a You're chick. A girl. <laughs> yeah, I, I'm ashamed to say that nothing offends me anymore. <laughs> just keep wearing the headband; that'll remind them. Yes. Sparkles, yeah. let's <laughs> glitter. There's a girl in the room. Glitter and glittery shoes. That's right. Yeah. Let's talk about. Next, next thing of let's talk about um, relationships and everything emotional. Like that's what I'll do. Yeah. Ooh, I'll, this is like, like a leave that. I'll just leave that topic going so you constantly know that I'm a girl. Because yeah. I am a girl. A girly girl? A girly girl. A I girly am a pretty girl. girly girl. All right. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> but I like football and action movies. <laughs> 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 okay. Well, thank you guys so much. Thank uh, you. One last chance for a question before we wrap it up. Anybody? 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 All right. Well, let me just say, you guys were wonderful. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you, guys. You guys were absolutely wonderful. And I'm not just saying it because you're in the room, because I don't usually gush after an act. Oh, but I, gush. I, love I it. was standing over there. I asked George, how many times did I say, Wow. Thank oh, you very thank much. You, how many times? <laughs> One. Zero. 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 Yeah. George, <laughs> George, George, come on. Back me up here. <laughs> I said wow once. Well, we so, had such a great yeah, time. Thank great. you all yeah, so, thank much you so much for taking thank time you. out of your busy week. Thank you, thank you. And we, we have Lady pictures. Antibellum. Yeah, y'all, seriously, y'all come. We give free hugs. Oh, wow. All right, yes. thank you guys. And thank you guys for coming. Thank you. To